Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we have a haul for you guys and as you can tell by the title it is a Priceline haul. I have a few other bits and pieces that I'll show you at the end of this haul as well just that I picked up but yesterday I saw an advertisement for half price on cosmetics at Priceline so they have half price on most of their makeup um, or cosmetics, most of it, not all of it. Um, and then 30% off some things as well and then also some of their skincare was half price as well. So I went and took advantage. I didn't buy too much um, makeup products. Sorry. I got a kitten and she's like super adorable but she gets in amongst everything. This is Pippa. Yes, I know. She's so freaking cute. Look at you. Yes. <laughs> Okay, okay, yeah, you just want to go, okay. So she's just going to play on my bench while I film apparently and make lots of little noises, so don't mind that. But yeah, um, I went and took advantage. Like I said, I didn't get too much makeup while I was there just because, I don't know, I, I find it hard to buy makeup these days. Like I feel like I've got, I haven't got a lot of makeup, but I do have more than like the average person, I guess, so... Yeah, I just find it hard to shop for makeup now. There wasn't really anything that stood out with me. And saying that though, my price line near my house is very, very small. So yeah, they don't have all of the brands that like the bigger price lines have. Um, if they did, I probably would have got a few more pieces from those brands, but they didn't have them. So yeah, but anyway, I thought I got a decent amount of things. So I thought I'd show you guys, but yeah, we have a little bag full. You're in my lipsticks. Wow. Um, the first thing I got is this powder here. This is the Australis Fresh and Flawless powder. I have not tried this before. It's been around for ages. I never got around to trying this. Um, and I thought I would pick it up because it was something like $6. I'll tell you guys prices because I've got the receipt in here as well. Um, I think this one went down to like, yeah, $6.97, which is crazy cheap so I thought I would pick that one up to try it. I wanted to get this because apparently it's comparable to the Max Studio Fix and I'm going to test it out because I love the Studio Fix powder but yes yeah I love the Studio Fix powder so it'd be nice to find like a drugstore alternative as well so I picked that one up mine is in the shade Nude the next thing I got is also from Astralis and I literally got this because it was a mini they had like a stand of mini things and this just stood out to me come on I honestly could have picked them all up, but I limited myself to one because I don't need a ton of stuff just because they're minis. But I love bronzers, so I thought I'd get this one. This is the sweet like chocolate bronzer. I also had the little banana powder um, in my basket, but I decided not to get that because the banana powder just goes yellow underneath my eyes and I know I probably won't use it all that much. So I just picked up this little bronzer one to try. It's called Ganache Gold. So I'm excited to try that one out and see what it's like. It says it smells like chocolate too. Let's open it and have a look. Oh, I hate that. Don't you hate that when they put like... I understand they're doing it to like keep it so that people don't touch it. But it's super annoying when they put sellotape over the products. What? You're very needy. Come here. I don't really think that smells like chocolate. I wouldn't say that's chocolate scented. Like vanilla-ish. I don't know why it smells like barley, but it does. Like vanilla, like, I don't know, that's weird. That doesn't smell like chocolate to me though. Um, but yeah, I'll try to give that one a go and see what it's like. And then pretty much everything else I got is skincare. Um, so let's get into that. The first thing I picked up is some watermelon Carmex. Oh, by the way, the bronzer was $2.50. Um, I picked up the Watermelon Carmex. I love, love, love lip balm. Um, if you've been watching me for a while, you know that I love lip balm. So I decided to pick this up. I think this was like $2.99 or something. Yeah, on your face now. <laughs> um, yeah, this was literally like $2.99. Um, I love Carmex. I've got one of the Carmex. Um, I just like the warming feeling on my lips that it gives. So I picked up that one. I love like watermelon scented things. So I decided to try that. I went a little bit overboard and I bought, I don't know why I needed all this, but I bought three, three packets of wipes. The first ones I got were the Dr. Lewin's Private Formula Vitamin Infused. There's a lot going on right now. There's a cat jumping everywhere. 
my phone's going off oh my gosh but yeah i got the dr lewin's um private formula vitamin infused micellar cleansing wipes i really really love wipes because i like to be able to just quickly wipe my makeup off um when i get home from work like i don't like leaving my makeup on my skin for so long um if i'm not at work or if i'm home and i know i'm not going out or anything i love to just be able to quickly take it off i don't use wipes as like my sole cl face cleaning um cleanser but i do use it just to wipe the makeup off my face so um yeah i've stopped up now but i got the dr lewin's ones these were um 3.99 so i got those ones i also got the burt's bees ones i'm excited to try these i've wanted to try burt's bees skincare for so long i've tried a few things from them but um i've tried more like body creams and hand lotions and stuff like that and their lip balms but never like their face skincare which i've been wanting to try so i picked up these ones here these are the burt's bees facial cleansing towelettes with white tea extract and these ones were $5.99 so yeah a little bit more expensive than the other ones that I got but I'm excited to try these ones out too I also got these ones here these are called the black express charcoal wipes I always really like interested in charcoal products for your skin because they're supposed to be really deep cleansing um so yeah I'll try these out and see what they're like um and yeah let me know if you guys want to know like some of my favorite wipes maybe i'll do a video on wipes because i'm obsessed with wipes the last things i have are all masks i went a little bit mask crazy because they were half price on pretty much all of their masks as well so i thought i'd stock up on some new ones i got this one here this is from seven he seventh heaven um black seaweed peel off mask this one's actually not for me this is for ella because he loves a peel off mask i mm, i don't mind peel off masks but i prefer like sheet masks and masks and like pots and stuff like that as opposed to peel off ones so yeah i got him this one because he's always asking me do i have a peel off mask and so yeah i got that for him so he can use that one i got two sheet masks from dr lewin's um this one here is the jellyfish collagen hydrating face mask um with hyaluronic acid um this one just like intrigued me because it said jellyfish collagen so hopefully this makes my skin like nice and soft and supple um so yeah i have that one I also got the brightening vitamin C face mask. I feel like my skin's been a little bit dull recently, so I really wanted something that was going to make my skin like nice and bright and radiant. Um, and vitamin C is really good for that. So yeah, I picked up these ones. I might actually try one of those ones tonight. I love a good sheet mask. Um, and then I also got this one from Andalou Naturals um these looked really really nice actually this is the pumpkin honey glycolic mask um it's brightening um i was just really intrigued by this like pumpkin and honey sounds really interesting so yeah i picked up that one or maybe i'll try this one instead tonight it has fruit stem cell science so yeah super excited to try out all those masks a lot of my masks have gone off so i need to go through all my masks and just get rid of the ones that have gone off because some of them i've had for a little bit too long now so i need to get rid of those i feel like i'm neglecting my kitty on. but yeah that is all that i got from priceline oh i forgot to tell you the prices of the mask the sheet mask was something like the sheet mask from dr lewin's these ones here were 4.99 each and then this one here was 11.49 um and this one here was two dollars 39 so yeah um I love it when Priceline have sales. I always go a little bit nuts, but it's a good time to stock up. The next place I went to was Big W because Big W is right next to um, Priceline. So I decided to pick up a few things there as well. The first thing I got is this hair, and this is the Dr. Teal's um, Pure Epsom Salt Soaking Solution in Soothe and Sleep with Lavender. I got this because I've been loving having baths recently because it's so cold here in Sydney. Um, especially at night during the day it's not too bad but at night it gets really cold so I like a bath just to keep me nice and warm so um, I picked up some Epsom salts and these like help soothe your body and relieve your mind help soften and smooth your skin um, so yeah I'm just gonna pop these in my bath and the lemon just will make me nice and relax before bed 
And the next thing I picked up is a water bottle because I need to keep myself hydrated. I haven't been drinking a lot of water recently and I just feel like I need to drink a lot more water. And drink bottles to me tend to be the way to go when it comes to drinking water. Um, so I picked up a new one. My other one, like I kind of didn't want to drink out of it anymore because it was white and it just got really dirty. It had like a bunch of makeup and stuff on it and no matter how many times I cleaned it because it was white, it just didn't want to be clean anymore. So I picked up a new one and this one has an infuser in the middle of it, which is cool. So I can put fruit and stuff in it, like lemons and stuff. Um, so yeah, I got that one. And then I also just picked this up as well. And this is a word search puzzle book. Um, I've also got a Sudoku one as well, but the Sudoku one sometimes I just find too hard for my brain. So I decided to pick up the word search because I love word searches. And this one was just like a really pretty one. I liked the look of it. So yeah, I love doing that. I try and stay off my phone because sometimes I'll literally sit there the whole night and just scroll on Instagram on my phone. Um, go on Facebook, just go on everything on my phone and it's become like a habit where I literally just sit on the couch the whole night and I'll stare at my phone. And it's so bad and it gives me a headache so it's nice to have something other than my phone to be doing. So yeah, I picked up that one that was like $5. And then I also got these. Do you know how excited I am about these? I thought these were only sold in New Zealand. So these are Perky Nana ones. Well, the normal ones that you get are called pineapple lumps in New Zealand. They're like a soft pineapple chewy lolly with chocolate around the outside and they are the bomb.com. Um, and my friends was like, oh, they brought perky nana ones out as well in New Zealand. So I was like, oh my God, amazing. Can you bring me some back? She's just gone to New Zealand. Um, and then I went to Big W and they freaking had them there. They're so good. I eat them way too much, but they are amazing. Perky nana is more of like a I don't think it tastes banana-y. I reckon it tastes more like... I mean, it is banana -y, but it's also like really tangy as well. Um, but these are freaking amazing. If you haven't tried pineapple lumps, if you're not from New Zealand, maybe you haven't. Um, if you haven't tried pineapple lumps or perky nana lumps, definitely give them a go. They are amazing. But anyway, that brings us to the end of this haul. These are the things that I picked up yesterday when I went out for a little trip. Let me know if you guys want to see um, reviews or you would like me to do a first impression on any of the masks or anything that I picked up. Um, just let me know in a comment down below. But yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Comment, request, subscribe and like. And I'll see you all in my next one. Bye.